We're a charity and we are here to give wonderful experiences and improve people's lives in Peterborough. Our mission is to ensure that wherever people in Peterborough come to our venues, they have a wonderful experience, a learning experience, and one where they can feel better. My job is really to harness the resources of Avacity uh, to make sure the organisation delivers on its promise, which is all about changing people's lives. And we do that through over 20 different centres, all providing great opportunities. In the arts, through the key theatre in the City uh, Gallery, through our library service, through our heritage service, and through our extensive sports service. We want to make the city a truly great place. The income that Vivacity receives from its various activities is reinvested to make our experience that we offer to our customers even better. I am one of Vivacity's 400 volunteers. But I suspect if you asked each one of them why they volunteer, you'll get 400 different answers. I just love passing on my knowledge to the public. I love their reaction um, and I hope it encourages them to come to Vivacity sites. If I can just encourage one young person to come back to Flagfen and then perhaps go to Longthorpe Tower, visit the museum, then I feel I have done a good job. For me, the Vivacity experience is all about fun and communicating that to the public because if we're having fun, the public are having fun and that, that gets, the message gets out there and when we're having fun we know that we learn more, we um, have a more fulfilling life. It's just that's what we are all about, the essence of Vivacity is fun. I think Peterborough is fortunate in having an organisation like Vivacity because it has genuinely changed the way that people perceive Peterborough in terms of culture, heritage, entertainment and sport. So as a charity we do that in four ways. Uh, firstly we want to champion and influence the city and make it a great place to live, work and play. Um, secondly, we're all about improving the quality of what we do. We want things to be better because we believe that that will take us to our third key objective which is about increasing the number of people that take part. And by doing that, we'll actually get more money in through the tills and we'll get ourselves into a virtuous circle of better quality, meaning more people, meaning more money through the tills. And of course, that will come back to the first point I made, a charity changing the lives of people. We do that through a wonderful customer experience when our customers come to all our venues where they can learn, they can enrich their lives we're a charity and that's the business that we're in. I think we should greet our customers always with eye contact, friendly personality, and you only get one chance to make a good first impression. So I think it's important for all staff to treat customers well. From what the customer can gauge out of their experience with a member of staff, they will then base their impression on how we are as a facility, how we are as a company, you know, what our services are to them, how, how good they think we are going to be to them if they decide to join up with us. People expect good level of customer service. It doesn't matter whether they walk into libraries or whether they go into a sports centre. There has to be consistency and there has to be quality. The customer matters, the customer is important and we need to make sure that they feel that from the minute they step onto our premises. If they meet someone who can bring history alive or bring you know, marine reptiles or the wealth of fossils that we have in this area alive to that person and switch them onto history, you know, we're all, we will all benefit from that. The advice I would give to new starters or volunteers is to always inquire. Like, if you want to know something, ask. Everybody's willing to help. Um, get involved with customers. They like to interact um, and just generally be friendly. But above all, our business is about people. And what we want to do is to work with great people and keep great people by training them and supporting them so they can be advocates for our business. Whether it's through the first phone call or the first hello at the desk, we want that hello to be with a smile and we want the person to be greeting our customers uh, in the right way, first time, every time.